Simpson Strong Tie is proud to introduce version 4.2 of the CFS Designer software. This version has added some new additions and enhancements to your cold form steel design software. Let's take a look at some of the bigger changes. Version 4.2 added a new Spandrel module. This new module allows you to design typical Spandrel framing, including the typical stud, kicked stud, kicker, bottom track, and connections, to help you design faster and more accurately. The Spandrel layout has been designed to be easy and quick to use. Starting from the upper left-hand side, we have the dimension input, followed by a tab of the free body diagrams. On the bottom left are the inputs, and the upper right has the member settings. Below the member settings is the member summary and connector summary. Taking a closer look at the free body diagram section, there are three tabs to choose from, typical stud, kick stud, and bottom track. The free body diagrams are updated as each input is changed. This allows the user to review how the dimension and load changes affect the free body diagrams. Connections have never been easier for spandrels. Simply design each connection with easy to follow images and interactions. Connections can be designed for the typical stud, kicked stud, as well as the kicker. The spandrel member and connector summary allow users to easily review designs on screen without opening the output. Finally, the output is organized to provide all pertinent information in a concise, easy-to-read format. Many other enhancements beyond the new Spandrel program were also added. Design time was improved for wall stud, beam input, and one-span opening modules by optimizing programming. An option was added in member settings for wall stud, beam input, and one span opening to allow easy input of two and three stud non-composite members. This allows easy input of members and does not design for nor require any special stud orientation. Another big enhancement to version 4.2 is the selector button in member settings. The selector button was added to the wall stud and beam input modules to allow users to change from a range of members. Simply select the flange, mill range, and CFS Designer will check all members within this range. The designed members can be organized by member, interaction, deflection, or member weight. This member selector button is optional, and users who prefer to select a direct member can do so the same way as they have in the past. The in-wall stud and beam input image was updated with a reference for the sloped load as well as an easier-to-read output for these sloped loads. In the wall stud module, the on-screen summary has been enhanced to provide the allowed capacities in addition to the code check and required forces. This allows the user to toggle back and forth between the code check interactions, required forces, and the allowed capacities. Connections have been added to beam input for horizontal orientation. Users can now select between side-attached connections, bearing attachments, and hangers. In addition, beam input and floor joist modules now have the option to select from connectors where the joist bears and joist does not bear on support. This allows for more flexibility in connection design. The Beam Input Module Summary report for horizontal orientation has been completely redesigned to be easier to read. The load combinations in the rafter and stacked wall module have been simplified to have less required input with automatic load combination names. Names are now automatically determined based on the load factor set by the user. To provide more workspace report options, a checkbox has been added to quickly toggle all options on or off in the custom workspace. Also, as an additional organizational option, you now have the ability to organize models alphabetically independent of the module that it was created in. Section Properties Report has been enhanced with an image of the selected section. Simpson Strong Tie leads the industry in tested products. We test CFS connectors to build a trusted brand. We strive to make CFS Designer the best software in the industry and are working hard to improve it. If you have any comments or questions, please email us.
We would love to hear your feedback.